What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, ran by the ranch, healed everybody on up, and we are finally ready to go after some proto relics. I wonder when the proto relic stuff in the other zones opens up. <laughs> I bet it is. Which actually, real fast, let me, uh, Yuffie. You need your magnify back. Magnify. Sorry, Red. Uh, instead of that, we'll give you. No, let's give Red gravity. And then instead of gravity, we're going to give Tifa something to knock off shields. Because if shields are up, not deep brave. Yes, enervation. I think having, having access to bump those off of stuff is going to be quite necessary. So she can empower or she can deep protect and de-shield. I think that's a good, good play for her. This material, where are you? No need to be shy, come on. Yuffie's gonna take you home. Yuffie! Nile! Hulk! Belly Bob! It's so good to see you! You too! We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Nothing can kill this bloom. <laughs> Clearly. Hmm? Say, where's Sonon? Um... Here... Hey! You three! <gasps> the Splinter Cell! Well, where are my manners? These guys are from Avalanche HQ. They're the ones who helped me out back in Midgar. And I don't think they need an introduction. Y'all were at the Shinra building, weren't you? Tell me... Was Wedge with you? Or did you see him? If you can tell me anything, anything at all, please. Wedge, he... I'm sorry. Don't be. Just... I need to know. After the Sector 7 plate fell, the things we saw and heard... All the carnage... It was... hell. We wanted to help, we really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless. That's when the call came, from the folks at Avalanche HQ. We learned it was the company that dropped the plate, and that they were gonna drop another, unless we stopped them. HQ needed volunteers to help storm the Shinra building. This was our chance. We knew it was the right thing to do. All of us. Wedge and I ended up being assigned to the same truck. <sighs> we'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. From there, we make our way up, taking each and every floor. Hmm. We've lost contact with Lucia's team. <sighs> I think we have to assume they're all... That's enough. First, We'll check in with Matt. On it. Let me just scooch on over here. I'm Wedge with the Splinter Cell. Uh, Barrett's crew, right? Mm -hmm. Here, try one of these. It'll help you calm down. Thank you. Go on, eat up. <laughs> Our team was heading upstairs to take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Avalanche doesn't do that. But when the plate fell, the rules changed. <sighs> Thanks for the assist! Help me out here! Alright, 
right, we're almost there, boys. <sighs> At long last, we're gonna take back our world, find the bastards who stole it, and send them to hell. Yeah! yeah. I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, but I didn't want them to get hurt, sir. <laughs> Go! I'll catch up! Right. We were all fired up. Ready to fight. Be alive. Oh wait. Uh, oh no. Oh my God. He's definitely not alive. We couldn't believe it. It was him. Thank you. <laughs> Damn it. Don't worry. It's all good, bro. Baron, those who pass on become one with the life stream. I know what you thought you heard, but it was probably just the wind. <sighs> Whatever. In times past, the Cetra came to fonts like these to give thanks to the life stream. There aren't many left, so we wanted to help preserve the few still standing. It felt like the least we could do, you know? For all those who return to the planet. Hey, Barrett. Why don't we give them a hand? Help them spruce things up. There anything we can do for you? I don't know. Restore the planetary fonts? They're this region's main source of energy. And kind of like relief valves for the life stream. But when they're as busted as this one here, you can't even get close to do repairs. Mako's way too dense. So, we figured we'd use a probe, fix the fonts remotely. Thing is, little guy's just too old. Probably better off in a junkyard than with us. Perhaps I can be of service? Robotics is one of my areas of expertise. Meet Robot Chadley. <laughs> Or Robo Chat, if you prefer something abridged. At any rate, you should now have complete control over him. Go on, ask him to do something. Beep, ba ba ba. Must program robots with gambits and actions, then send them into battle with the aim of reaching the center of the spring and vanquishing the enemy leader. Emerging victorious will restore the planetary font. Okay. So it's like, uh, like an auto battler? Times three types of robots, each operating in accordance with its gambits and actions, which are programmed prior to battle. Actions determine what the robot will do, gambits determine the target. For the first battle, we'll choose the AI set by Chadley. Okay, so foe, target foe weak to an element. This is like uh, Final Fantasy XII. Element weakness is a priority, then target other foes. Element foe weak to an element, then target foes. And we have a thunder, fire, and a blizzard. This thing, King Flan, restores some HP instantly, then more over time, deals a large amount of damage. Oh no, these are mine. Hybrid loadout. So I can either have a regen and a comet, big wind damage and a comet, or regen and then a buff. Uh, let's do the regen and buff. Uh, 
Deployed from any of the three portals, will then move along their lane towards the enemy leader in the center. Press X to view each available robot's gambits and actions. The icons above a foe indicate its elemental weakness. Try to deploy robots that can exploit these vulnerabilities. Effective against foes weak to ice, effective against foes weak to fire, against effective against foes weak to lightning. Okay, that's straightforward. So he is shock. As you can see, you can switch between portals as allows you to deploy robots in other lanes and outmaneuver. The three portals share an HP gauge. This is reduced to zero, you will lose the battle. Okay, so I want to deploy a lightning man. Bottom left slowly fills. Once it's reached the required amount, you can deploy another robot. ATB cost of each robot type varies according to its gambits and actions. Try deploying another unit once the ATB gauge is full. Note that you can always assess enemies. Alright, so I would now deploy a fire robot. I'm just going to prioritize this. Yeah, it's like an auto battler that's somewhat similar to... Uh, to Fort Condor, but this is more about deploying them. Press X allows you to view all information on enemy units. Same method can be press square. We're gonna go cautious courage, range wide. We're gonna buff him now. We're gonna buff these guys up. Go, my little robots. Boop, 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 boop. Targeting. Uh, designated by one, so make sure you assess them to avoid triggering their advanced condition. So, 50% phase shifts reconfigures. Four plus robots present in lane, it'll cast a barrier. Currently targeted by five foes, it does a mighty splat. Okay. Remember, you must defeat the boss in the allotted time. So he's already triggered his barrier, but currently targeted one two splat. Oh, that, that wasn't nearly as much of a threat. Oh, well it's a one two, so it is. But yeah, you're you're cooked, bro. So I guess in, in theory you'd want to keep as few robots out as possible so that you are not triggering the ability, but overloading, I mean, they, they still just wrecked it. Okay, I think this is actually perfect. I can hit this and then do a turn. And then... 
Put that. Grab this for the fast travel. resembles that of a proto-relic, I surmise these structures were designed to contain one. For now, let's continue to restore them. I'm sure we'll find something within. The planet itself is guiding us. I've also developed an additional AI chip for RoboChat. Hopefully, it expedites our work. Program your bots with gambits and actions. Gambits determine a target. Yes, we know all this. Enhance your chances of victory. Reference the information on enemy units before programming your robots, which can be done with X. You can also auto program if this stage is giving you trouble. Uh, enemy leader Intel uses potent attacks when several robots are deployed in a single lane or when attacked by robots. Okay. Um, I mean, yeah, these, these look. Fine, each robot has several AI slots in which it can be programmed. Once a robot is deployed, it'll act accordingly. And yeah, we know how a gambit system works. Foe weak to an element. So what's the difference between foe weak to an it prioritizes foe's weak the designated actions element. Prioritize foe's weak to the designated action element. Prioritizes foes or targets foes. There's no real difference. Uh, yeah, we would just always prioritize a foe that's weak to the element. Hmm. Yeah, so if it's weak to an element, use fire shot. Otherwise, use lariat. Long-ranged non-elemental attack. Well, this guy is weak. Moderate amount of damage. Let's just go for the damage setup. I think we're we're fine. It's just a flan. Okay. Uh, lightning man. Fireman.
ice just popped up over there. I'm trying to go with as few as possible. Uh, so he's going to switch and spawn. Four plus in lane targeted by five foes. So I kind of want to wait because right now he could potentially get targeted by five after they kill these guys. Targeted by three, four. Uh, portal skills. Damn, meteor just like. Oh shit! I should have saved that. Okay. Uh, we're, 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 we're. There's a fire guy over here. There's a whatever guy over there. We're gonna put one over there. Uh, let's do a second fire guy. This one needs an ice guy. I'm glad I was saving all that. So yeah, that spawn condition, I didn't know it was... I didn't know it was like that. That was like, wow, that was a lot. So definitely save the... Let me see, where did you go? So yeah, I should wait until he spawns all of his stuff next time, and then drop my spells, just wipe him out. I mean, we still got this. He's trying to like haste and stuff, it's not gonna matter. At this point, we're just pumping out units. want to have something that does like long range shots just to, to stop this bullshit. Come on little guys. Shoot him. Smack him. Smack him. Are they going to fail? Bro, what? Oh my god. All right. Oh, I'm going to I'm going to bah. I'm just going to save my my comet to kill it at the end. So at 50%, he's going to spawn. At that point, I'm going to do my wind. Four in lane, he gets bravery. Targeted by five, suppose he does splat. Oh, you know what? I need an extra Gambit on. Because he's gonna do foe nearby, Vicious Bite. Got it, got it. I know, hang on a second. Can I... That's why I was like, oh, this Gambit's set up. No, I fucked up. Set. Uh, f the last thing would be I don't get what that meter is I guess that maybe it costs more ATB to do it red can be our fire guy our lariat and I can only have one person with it. Automatically outfit your robots with one of the four AI sets optimized for the stage. Let me see what it does if I auto- Oh, what the fuck? Oh, you have cure shots and regen shots? 
so you would not be doing ice. Oh, wow, this is way different. Oh! Oh, shit. This is... Okay. So you would cover all my elemental bases. You're gonna buff stuff and shoot missiles. And then you're gonna heal? Okay, let's try that. And they have increased costs. So, in all cases, I would deploy him. Heels. You smack you. You're like a tank. Huh. I think just playing to the elements is easier. Four plus robots in a lane. Have you in the back line shooting the right elemental shot? I think having each of them with the elemental shot is still good. Gen shot doesn't seem very good. Cure shot seems like it could have some potential. I was just going to give him a missile. Just so they can backline stuff. Saving that, that's huge for the spawn phase. He's going to start doing his 1-2. But I have guys that are long range now, so I should be fine for 43 seconds. Actually, you know what? Let's, um... Oh, he's dead. Huh. I didn't even get to Meteor. I guess they all just shot at the same time. Guys were trying some new cocktails for me. Mmm. Yep. This is the one. Bartender, whip me up another Costa del Sol. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I'm cutting you off. <laughs> Come on. One more couldn't hurt. Now me, I'm a Cosmo Canyon guy. Mmm. That one was pretty good, but it was missing that. Spot. Special flourish. Guess what I got? Huh? Ta-da! Cosmo salt. Can't call it a Cosmo Canyon without a touch of local flavor, right? Trust me, a dash of this will make all the difference. What's Cosmo about it? It's mined from the canyon itself, the birthplace of planetology, and pretty hard to come by, I'll have you know. Oh my god. That cell's gotta be laced with something. Wow! <laughs> You're right! Wow! It's like a whole new drink. Man, it's 
too bad the stuff is so hard to come by. If only I had more. I thought you might say that. Cut out the whole store so you can keep on mixing. <laughs> but those will only last us so long. Especially if this Cosmo Canyon becomes a hit. Gonna need to stock up. In that case, what about a trip to the source, huh? We could all bring back as much salt as we could carry. What do you say? Count me in. Home of Planetology, here we come. It's gonna be great. Oh, really? Huh? Y'all think we got money to be taking field trips? Because our books say otherwise. Here. <laughs> there you have it. The boss himself says it's a done deal. To our generous leader. <laughs> to to Barrett. Barrett. Honestly, y'all are just too much. <laughs> <laughs> Look, guys, we made it. Would have liked to have gotten here sooner, but. It already? Ages ago, slow folks. Come on, double time. Coming. Guessing it's in there. Hmm. What's it up above, though? Yes, it is. And we found the path. This is a fun proto relic, just getting, you know, very uh, backstory friendly. Where's our little uh, robot friend? There you are. Well, well, y'all beat us to the punch for once. Not that it mattered, we still can't reach the font. And there's a weird fiend. Got any smart ideas? Let's do a different one. Let's uh, set auto program. All right, so you have cure shot, gravity shot, blizzard shot. See, I like that they still have their respective elements on this. Let's try that. Uh, what about a target this time? Uh, changes its elemental affinity and weakness upon losing HP and uses different magic. Set gravity shot or missile, which will ground them. We have gravity shots and missiles. Let's do it. Oh, that's what the little icon meant. It'll attack fire stuff. Uh, you shift to ice. 
when you're at below 60, four residents, they have four robots, you get barrier, five foes, you'll do toxic, deluge, vicious, and mighty splat. So what phase is he in now? Let's get something back there, get some damage, start hitting him. Oh, toxic deluge already? Oh no, it's just foe, foe mid-range, toxic deluge. to the self barrier bro and then let's do you with a cure shot to heal up yeah that's big Doing a fair amount of stuff, but I feel like we are we are looking good here. He got a lot though. You're getting cooked at the moment. Now that he's shifting to ice, I should add some fire into the mix. He's gonna be the one too, that's okay. Big damage from, the, from that. Yeah, I like this setup a lot. Uh, let's use a portal skill. It's got like a little bit of regen coming in. You're dead, but we're making sure you're dead. Throw out some nice shots. Think that did the trick? Yep, this font's good to go. Man, we really are dead weight, aren't we? Just slowing you down. Blessings of the planet be upon you. <laughs> <laughs> and what about you, my dear child? What truth have you to tell us this night? Really, guys? Me? You, a resident gourmand. Come on, let's hear it. <laughs> Um, well, I guess... Uh, Can't hear you. The, the truth is... Uh, the truth is, I just want to do more for you guys. I'm sick of feeling like dead weight around here. I just... I... For the love of God, not this again. Come on, out with it. Which one of us said that? Was it me? Biggs? Or was it? <gasps> no, nobody said anything, honest. But you never would. You guys are too nice for that. You really think she's too nice? I'm nice to those who deserve it. <laughs> See? <laughs> what did I tell you? <laughs> Uncle! Uncle! <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, we wouldn't be here without you. Huh. Was always down on himself, even though he shouldn't have been. Wedge worked harder than any of us. That's just 
who he was, always trying to do better. Yeah. <laughs> that guy. If only he'd stuck to looking after his cats and enjoying good food. Let's go. close to that. Is it past this? No, it's up above. Let me, um... It's probably way... Yeah, it's up top. Okay, I gotta get up to, like... Uh, how would I get up there? I mean, I have an idea of how to get up there. It's not starting on the ground. Um, get up, up. What is that tower? What am I looking at? Let me go. Hmm. I definitely need to choke about my way up. I'm gonna get much higher than I am right now, though. It's a landing pad. Um, look at the map. This. That looks like a maybe. Hang on, there we go. Now I can actually see it. Uh, I might be able to just go there from here. I think I can glide over there if I hit that that wind. I might not even need the wind. I think I can run up that tower to get where I want to go. I don't think that I would take this before. I got only three ATB. Okay, I want to try and execute that if I can. So, to do that, I would need Yuffie to throw out some stuff for Yuffie and Tifa. Sorry, Ski Ski. Yeah, it's not happening here. I'll just take this thing out. I would need, like, the... 
the Mega Scorpion. It's something like that if I'm gonna climb up. Set advanced actions that may have a plus, such as augmentation and shock. To program them, you must select from one of four additional conditions. They're extremely powerful, so be sure to program them to trigger at the best possible moment. Okay. Uh, changes to elemental affinity. Both whips and marshmallows will spawn. Also, the enemy leader can change his elemental affinity and possess enhancing the feebling skills. Uh... How do I put on the crazy things? I don't see those at all. Uh, need the tutorial again? No, that's the... Oh, hang on, there's probably a page for it. Advanced actions. Augmentation at shock plus. Or, oh, hang on. Um, self, modify HP and cost. Oh, wait a minute. I'm modifying... Oh, interesting. Okay, so it has... By putting these together, I have a hundred more HP and I'm cheaper. Huh. I would need, let me go to you. Probably remove one. Like that, okay. Shock plus. Grounding that are any airborne, you must select an advanced action condition. So, shock plus, if you have, your health is less than 50. Otherwise, we're going to missile at airborne. Yeah, 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 cool. All right. Let's do it. So, my lightning boy is going to pump. He's casting a lot of bullshit right now. 
Let's him do fire and ice. We'll base shift to lightning soon. Yo, bro, get off the crystal, man. Damn! Alright, assuming it's gonna do the same thing, we're gonna double up on a lightning at the start. I think that's honestly the best thing to do, is just... Let the ATB charge up the second you see a spawn, spawn the counter for it, and then just let them clean house from there. Damn, that shock plus thing is mean. That's some serious damage. Two fire guys, they're gonna prioritize him. Uh, we're down one minute and his health isn't looking too low. Those guys have already used up all their stuff, so I need him to like focus fire them. Do you have uh, phase shift all any weakness fire? So he's just gonna he's gonna do do st oh wait he doesn't have a, a sh he just has phase shift so I can load up this whole thing is he's gonna try and just kill everybody so I want to load up as many dudes as possible here. He's gonna phase shift to lightning. I'm gonna. Hit him with one of those. And then I'm also gonna hit him with this. You can mighty splat all you want, bro. You ain't surviving this. Uh, I need Ice Man and Fire Man. Man, he is healing a good amount, though. Shit! Did I misplay this? Come on, 30 seconds. Fuck, I think I did. I'm gonna believe the party can still pull it off, but I think I, I, uh, I think I, I blew my load, so to speak, a little bit too soon there. Yeah, let's let's restart this. I gotta wait until he's really low before I meteor. Meteor would have definitely won that, but I was like, I'm gonna rush him down, and I popped it too soon, and then as a result, he started regening and shit. So we put lightning out. And then another lightning. And then over here, we're gonna do two ice. I'm just gonna let it build up, that way they both hit at the same time. Ice costs how much? 11. Yeah, this is the play. We 
Because I was like, oh, he's not going to spawn extra. I'm just going to chill. I'm going to do my thing. And then when I decided to do that, all of a sudden, it was, uh, that's when he was like, I'm spawning in everything. And I was like, I don't have any ATV left. And even though he doesn't say it, he definitely does spawn in. He spawned in a good chunk of shit towards the end there, so I gotta save my, my portal skills. Come on, Robo Battler. Lots of ATB. The bigger thing is just not letting it cap out. Wait, wait for the spawns. He's gonna phase shift to lightning, so now frost would presumably be good. Yeah, he's weak to frost right now. And I'm almost a cap, so let me toss out a frost. The frost with the lightning, they can reuse the, the last use thing, which is pretty cool. Triggers your region. Let's kill them off for now. And then I'm gonna. shot, fire shot, lightning, lightning, need to get a fire over here. Fire, 26 seconds, that's his last heal, where you've taken out a majority of the ads. He's currently using Faraga, he's weak to lightning. So we're going to start throwing lightning dudes out. Come on, team. Come on. Come on. Big damage. Big damage. I don't think they're going to get it in time. It's so close, but they're not going to get it in time. Damn it. Oh, man. I thought I had it that time. I think I used my, my thing just a little, little too soon. Um... I think the I think our setup is right. I think I just I didn't have I gotta play to his weaknesses more. Cause I gotta force those regions out of him early. Oh wait, because as soon as that thing spawns, that's when I gotta spawn in. Because otherwise, he's just going to attack and blow them up. Let's waste that ATB. And then, you need a fire in like half a second, don't you? I want to say this needs a fire. In a moment. Spawn, spawn some ants. I know you want to. Spawn them. Multiple pages here? No. Add the fire guy out to blow that dude up as soon as it's up. Yes, target the shocks. That's good. And we're gonna pump elements as soon as he does his phase shift. Let's 
let's go now. Fire, because he's gonna he's gonna shift to lightning. Okay. I'm gonna do ice now. It's gonna do a splat. It's okay. We got three lightning dudes up. We kind of blew our, our whole portal. We dumped every portal out there, but everybody is about to hit him with lightning, and that's what he's weak to right now. And we have new robots to counter them. He's going to mighty splat. We only have one up front on him. Come on, you asshole. Oh, damn it, I should have saved my AoE. I think I can still pull this off. Why are you running past him? Big shock. Things dead. Like it's only three minutes, but damn dude, that three minutes is hard. I don't have ice or fire over here. No, I do have blizzard shots. He's gonna kill it. Fuck! Ah! This is this. Ugh! I'm so close to it. It's always in like the last minute, in the eleventh hour he counters. I just need to wait. I, I did it again. I need to just hold off on my portal skills. I save my portal skills. I win this. That's that's all I got to do. I just hold off on the portal skills. I put those out at the the last moment to wipe out all of his stuff and I should be fine. Get off the crystal, bro. That was a misplay, but I think we'll be okay. Fire dudes out, have those shock explosions out there doing big damage. We're getting a lot of shock explosions right now. He's gonna shift to lightning. I got a lot of lightning on the field, not so much ice. Let him do his, his mighty splat. He's not getting the guys in the back line. There we go, the shock plus is coming out. All right, so we've pushed him really far at a minute and a half. That's good. That's really good. He's gonna start spawning all of his dudes in a second. He's face shifting to fire. They're gonna, he's got his regen up. That's expected. And some lightning up. Yeah, get on him little dudes. Larry at his ass. We got ATB is cooking. We got a minute. He has regen. I haven't touched my portal skills. Should wait. He's going to spawn more. Nice. And one lightning. And we also need a fire here. Wait, 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 wait. Now. Oh god, that one just spawned in right as I did it. There we go now. 
and then I spawn another shock to help take him out. We need two ice guys over here. Stat, 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 stat. Come on. That's one ice. No, 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 no. There's the second ice. Nice! Ooh, that last battle, man. Stressful. We got it. are out there making a difference i know but what do you say we'd be happy to tag along if uh... and who the hell said you could people not willing to die for the cause got no place with us uh, i'm sorry i just thought that your hearts are in the right place but y'all y'all got a different path to walk one that's all your own I can't eat another bite. <clears throat> I suppose it's time for yours truly to say his piece. Here it comes, the grand finale. May the planet guide your words. And keep them brief while she's at it. <laughs> <clears throat> so, the five of us here all came together because we wanted to save this planet of ours. Ain't made much money. Ain't made a lot of friends either. But the one thing we do have deep in our hearts is a passion. A fire that burns for the cause. That won't stop burning till Shinra goes up in smoke. The road ahead won't be easy. But I ain't stopping. Because even if it costs me my life, I'm taking down Shinra and taking back our planet. So if you got the guts, then come with me. <sighs> I'm hungry after all, for justice. <laughs> I. You know I'm in. My man. Well, if everyone's feeling it, how about we keep things going with another round? <laughs> Tifa, get me another Cosmo Canyon. Sure. Make it five. <laughs> <laughs> saying we should forget about them. No way I ever could. But you and me, we gotta stop living in guilt and regret. Yeah.
Today's a new day, people. So let's not waste it. Come on, y'all. <laughs> hey, wait. Forgot this. Here. With that, we have finished World Intel for Cosmo Canyon. And another proto relic is required. Gambit paid off. More of this dude. The knave returns. Beneath the moonlight, in victory shall I revel. My Genji! <laughs> Chadley? <laughs> None other. After analyzing the phenomena associated with your sudden disappearance, I was able to devise a way in which to join you virtually. Virtually. Ah! No matter. Be gone, foul conjurer, or I shall make this place your grave. Oh my! This is simply fascinating! <laughs> I'm Chadley. You must tell me about yourself, and about this place. You dare demand answers of me? Such impudence! A wanton display of disrespect! Blows of ah! wealth! Die! Why? What did I say? This will not stand! Chadley, you okay? I believe so, yes. Tell me I didn't dream that shit. Correct. That was no dream, Cloud. You and I were there, together. Wherever there was, that is. I presume it was another dimension. Nothing's ever simple. <laughs> I sense exasperation. I, however, am emboldened to solve this mystery. I only hope that you will assist me in my quest for answers. Let me go take a look. I just wanna... We're not gonna do it right now. This is already, uh... Cosmo Canyon Proto Relic took a hot minute, but let me see if there's rewards. So it's just high score. We don't get any, uh... We don't get any goodies for it. Alright, well, with that, we are... Oh, oh. This is like before. My world intel is done. He just, he's like, hey, you can do the hard mode if you want, but we don't need to do that for world intel. Um, but I think we're, we're ready to go. I think we're ready to warp back, make our way on to uh, Beebleheim. So yeah, stay tuned. I'll catch you next time with more.